Today we are going to be showing you a workshop called Dry Marbling. And for that workshop we're going to need, May, what are we going to need? Shaving foam. Shaving foam. Aiden, hold it up. Something. I need this. It's a pipette. A pet. Some inks, which you could use um, food colouring or anything liquid to paint. This. And this. But we will need some material and some paper. And a stir. Okay. Stir it up. I don't do it now. We're going to do it now. Okay. So the first thing we need to do is spray shaving foam onto a surface. Now, put something down. It could be cling film, a tablecloth, something that's easily wiped. All right. So. Aha. Uh -huh. I'm spraying it on to the do. table. Do you want to do something? Yes. I'm Okay. Ah, go over here. That's enough. Not much more. Now. I'm do it. You want to do a bit? Okay. You might get gooey fingers. You might get gooey fingers. Here you go. Press there, Aiden. Ah, right. We've got lots and lots of shaving foam. Now. Uh, it looks a bit like. Ice cream. And it's it, nuzzy, we're all going to take a wee stick now. Hold on. Yeah. Alright. But we're just going to flatten the shaving foam out. Flat up the top. That's it. Flatten it out. We want to make it a bit like a top of the cake. No. <laughs> I don't want that <laughs> Okay. And stop. we put those out of the way. Okay. I'm going to take those off. <laughs> it's alright. We've got our aprons on. So everyone, yes, make sure you put your aprons on. Now the next thing is we want to drip some colour onto it. Now, Maeve, what colour do you want to start with? Um, pink. Pink. And a touch of orange. Right, Maeve's going to start with orange, pink. So we're going to suck up with our suckers. Oh, that's a lot. Maybe squeeze it out really large. Now, you're going to dribble it all over the shaving room. Oh, a little less. Bit. Okay, Aiden, what colour do you want? Orange? Orange. All right. Orange is my favourite. Orange is your favourite. Where's the other sucker? Um, that one? Yes. Where is it? We need that one. We need that sucker. Uh, Aiden, you ready? Squeeze it up. That's it. And on here. Wow. Now your turn. Right, a bit more orange. A bit more orange in. Ooh. It ah. a little bit different if you're um, a mixed I mean, it looks like that. And that, oh, not yet. Now I'm going to choose a colour. I'm going to choose some blue. Ooh, look at those lovely colours. I think it'll be a little bit darker. There we go. Right. So we've got lots of splashes of colour on top of our shaving foam. And we need to take our sticks back again. Stick, Here's a stick. stick. There's a stick. Now very gently we're going to make some swirls into the paint. Like this. Very gently, not too hard. That's it. We're mixing the paint. Definitely. Now you can do this in any way you'd like. We're doing swirls, but you could drag it like this. Want to? Yeah, that'd be fun. We're mixing the colour in. What a detonna! You can do so much pattern. What a detonna! It's beautiful, isn't it? Beautiful colours. And oh, once it's you've done maybe that, maybe going to look beautiful. Again. <laughs> right, now we've done our swirling. What we need to do is make sure our paint's out the way and our sticks Why are out the that? way. Um, uh, out the way. And we're going to take now a sheet of paper. Right, maybe you show the sheet of paper. We've got a sheet of paper. Wait, before we put it on. Sheet of paper. And we, what are we going to do? Put it on the shaving foam. And very gently with our fingers. We are patting it down. That's it. Very down, not all the way down, just very lightly tapping it. Is it off? It's on the towel. There we go, it's okay. Right, we've done that. The next bit is pulling it up. And you can get a big person to help you with this. I'm going to get that. And whoosh. You should look a bit like that on your paper.
Okay, Maeve, Aidan and I have cleared up our table and the next step is to remove the shaving foam from the paper or the material to reveal the marbled artwork that you've created. And I'm going to use a window scraper. You see, you could use a piece of thick card, anything flat that's gonna help you push shaving foam off, okay? Maeve's holding a bucket because we're gonna scrape the shaving foam into the bucket. Maybe you got that bucket ready? Yes. Right. Now, I've got a little bit of a... Nothing in me Yes, you're going to help. I'm going to do the first bit. So maybe tip that bucket down a bit. And do it in one slide. <gasps> wow. Maybe you can put And you can play with it inside the bucket. Well, you could if you want to do. Tell, the, tell everybody, isn't it lovely? It looks gorgeous. So that's the end of our workshop. It's very, very simple. It's very fun and you get some really beautiful pictures at the end of it. And if you've seen my mark making workshop, you could actually cut out shapes from your paper if you've used it to make your own pictures. I'm going to hand you over to my co-facilitator Maeve and she's going to tell you what her favourite part was. This was my favourite part when I made this one and I love shaving the shape. Shaving from bed. It was very fun. I hope you have fun. Bye.